Yo, 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 what's good, everybody? Um, this is a late night recording, man. This is like 12.30, man. Yeah, it's a dang near 12.30. It's 12.20 right now. I just got done, bro. I was literally doing so much school. Spanish, bro. Spanish 2. Man, that shit's tough. No, it's not tough. It's just, like, long, bro. I, I have not done any. This is the preferred, like, the first or second day I started doing my work. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, I'm still, I'm about to finish unit one, but, yeah, there's four units I have to do by next week, which I, I'm pretty confident I'll get it done, but it, it definitely will be last minute, um, type stuff, but, yeah, anyways, let's get to it, um, I'm the stupidest man alive, Th there you go, I'll admit it, I can't believe I predicted the Bucks to win two games this series. I am the stupidest man alive. I can't believe I thought this series would be a great series. I am so disappointed in this series. I, I really am, you know. Um, the Bucks lost by 40 today. That's fucking madness. That is madness without James Harden, too. I forgot to add that part. Without James Harden. If there would have been a close game they lost, I've been oh, maybe I mean Harden's coming back, you know, the series is over. Whatever. But they still I mean regardless the series is over. It doesn't matter if I don't even like even if Kyrie is out, I think KD is enough to win this series. And Kyrie and Harden are out. I still think KD can lead this thing cuz KD is a monster, bro. Um but for real though, man. KD is just different he had 32 tonight right um um but he had 32 tonight and every time i was watching <laughs> keep in mind i didn't watch that i i didn't need to watch that much to know that you know what was going on i only watched it until about around halftime and th this game was over man um there was no point of even me watching past the first quarter to be honest any nba fan everybody knew after the for watching that first quarter, this game is over. Um, KD just every time I saw him pull up Jay from the mini, boom, it's just in. It's just his spot. He can get to his spot regardless. It doesn't matter who's guarding him. Giannis got Giannis was guarding him. Um, bro, it didn't matter. Giannis, you know, um, Kyrie got um, Gian Giannis with the move. Just checked in, wasted no time. Everton is for five here at the start. Irving with another move. Kyrie got blocked at the beginning of the game. Then comes back, hits Giannis with that. Boom, bang. Um, But Blake Griffin, let's talk about Blake Griffin. How he finessed Detroit for two two years, man. And, um, bro, for some reason, he all of a sudden has ups again. Now, it's not the, you know, Blake Griffin of the olden days, great, but, you know, it's Blake Griffin, look, look, this looked like Blake Griffin of the olden days. Look at this. Similarities in three-point shooting. Oh, sir. Oh, Griffin! Putting him Over in the, the defensive player of the year. The reigning MVP. Bro, the... He just did that, man, on... Bro, I, I, bro, what the frick, bro? Bro, he just all of a sudden gets to Brooklyn and has interest in playing it. I mean, it makes sense. It's Brooklyn, bro. You're gonna you're gonna get a free ring. Um, but, yeah, man. All you have to do is show a little production, you know? And, and also, when a guy like Chris Middleton shoots 7 of 20, that is terrible, man. That is terrible. Giannis only had 18. This game was already over by halftime, though, so that's fair why. But, yeah, it just doesn't make sense. Get, I don't know. It's time to fire Boot and Jose. They, I heard they were running, like, a two-on-three um, zone on the Brooklyn Nets, which is a terrible idea. One of the best scoring teams, one of the best scoring teams of all time. You know, you're running a two-on-three zone? Are you serious? Bro, and, I mean, yeah, it's crazy, man. Frick the freaking Nets, man. I just don't see a team that's going to beat them. Um, and on to the second game of the night, which is one I didn't really watch, to be honest. I was, I, I was busy. I was busy. I seriously was. I really wanted to watch this game, though. But I would tune in time to time. 
um, at first, this was just Nuggets' own game. They, they, they were playing pretty good. They were up. And then, in the second half, they the Suns went on a 16-0 run. Bro, and then at the end of the game, bro, these Phoenix fans are crazy, bro. These Phoenix fans are crazy loud. They, they for sure looked actually like they haven't been in the playoffs in 11 years, which they haven't been. Um... They that's they've been showing up. Look, look at this scenario right here that I'm about to show you. Look at this scenario and how um it was a crazy it was a crazy good scenario. I'm not talking about the fans, but look at it. I look at it just and speaking of CP3, bro. CP3, he's back. He's back. His shoulder looks like he's getting better. 21 today. He had 21 today. Devin Booker had 21 today. You know, um, and why couldn't Jay Crowder have played like this in like Cleveland, bro? He's he's, I don't like Jay Crowder, man. He's just he's just hooping right now, though. I can't hate, man. I can't hate. Mikel Bridges had twenty three. Woo! He's a great guy. He's a great player. He's great. He's a great young guy. His second year, I think, bro. That's crazy. And he's at, he has twenty three in a playoff game. Anyways, let me show. Look at this scenario, though. Look at this. Scenario. Paul and Capazzo, shot clock at four. Oh, go right by him. Go clock by him. Right to the rack. He smoked him. Three minutes gone in the fourth quarter. Two veterans going at one another right here. Chris Paul and Paul Millsap. Oh, a three by Chris Paul. Bodies on the floor like bowling pins. And Paul laces one up. He has been a flamethrower in this fourth quarter. There's a pit pocket by Sharich. Here comes Kane. Hold on for Kane. All I gotta say is, if that were my team and that scenario happened, I would be tri I would be going crazy. I mean, no, I was just showing. I showed the previous play before that crazy scenario because Chris Paul is just that dude, man. It's just crazy how different, how much of a difference he makes on a team. It's just crazy. Um, but yeah, he, he, he's definitely looking like he's getting back there. Oh yeah. He's getting back there. It's going to be scary for the league. Oh yeah. Um, but yeah, um, the Suns win game one. I mean, what more can you say? Can you say that you had, and then you had the little Timothy's in the crowd, you know what I'm saying? The little Timothy's man. Um, in the crowd, um, you know, cheering on for them Suns, but they were hyped though. They were hype as, they were hype, man. They were hype. But yeah, um, let's get it, man. Um, thank y'all, man. Thank y'all. You know, we've hit, we've had um, two hundred thirty views over the last four days, um, which is crazy good. Um, for me starting back up, you know, um, I'm actually I'm having fun doing this. It's fun making videos, man. It's fun. It, it feels good. I've never done videos like this. I've done live streams like this. But I've never done videos like this, and I can't live stream, so I can't do shit like this anyways, even if I wanted to live stream, talk about this shit. I can't. It's impossible. Um, YouTube does not let me live stream, which is freaking ridiculous. And yeah, thank y'all for, um, thank y'all for watching the videos, man. That shit means a lot. You know, um, I don't even... And some some people even like it. I think it's Brooke and Dylan though. I mean, possibly Griffin. Who knows? I don't know who likes the videos. But um, yeah, thank y'all for watching this video. Um, just remember, we got game one tomorrow. We got game two Hawks Sixers tomorrow, and then we got game one um, Clippers Utah in Utah. I'm excited for that series. By the way. I saw a video of Carl Malone smoking a cigar outside of the arena. We don't freak with Carl Malone, man. That's nasty what he did. You know, Carl Malone's a sick dude, man. We don't fuck with him, man. Um, but, yeah, thank y'all. Thank y'all again. Peace out. Um, who? I, wait, before I go, I got tomorrow. Let me make my predictions. I got Sixers tomorrow, and I got, and I got Clippers tomorrow. Yes, sir. Thank y'all for watching. Peace. Yo, my bad. Scratch that. <laughs> I'm back again. Um, DeAndre Ayton had 20. 
and 10, and Jokic had 22 and 9, but Aiden shot 9 and 13, and Jokic shot 10 and 23. My bad. My bad. But still, basically, you know, he neutralized Jokic from having above 30. You know, Jokic needs to play have above 30 for the uh, Nuggets to win, probably. Um, most definitely. Um, but yeah, thank y'all for watching again. This should be the last outdoor, I promise. Um, but yeah, peace, y'all. Thanks for watching.